Keep your heads lifted up, beautiful family in Jesus Christ. His timing is always perfect. And we will be raptured at the appointed time, right in the nick of time. And here's the verse of the day. And it's one of my all-time favorites. I absolutely love this verse. Revelation 22, 12. And behold, I come quickly and my reward is with me to give every man according as his work shall be. Matthew 9, 37. Then saith he unto his disciples, the harvest truly is plenteous, but the labors are few. Verse 38. Pray ye therefore the Lord of the harvest that he will send forth labors into his harvest. And I pray that almost every time I pray, all glory to our Father. And he answers prayers. And all glory to our Father and thank you family. I had just enough funds to give Sonia to ship out 87 packages, 8,700 flyers, rapture flyers with the signs on them. And as you can see right here, our sister Rhonda left a comment and she said, Praise Jesus, Pastor Patrick, and the dear sister who printed and sent them all out. I received my rapture flyers yesterday. They are just beautiful and very professionally printed with extra firm cardstock. Praise be to our Father in heaven. Thank you so much. I passed them all out last time and I'm excited to share these new ones again. Hallelujah and amen. Maranatha, brother and family of God. And he's pouring out his Holy Spirit upon me right now. So I just want to say thank you, family. Everybody that answered the call. Everybody that requested the flyers. God bless your path. Let's finish this race strong. And I need to order more backpacks and supplies and buy more food and water so I could hit the streets and hand out more packs. So if Yeshua is telling you to donate and you're able to, my link is in the description box under this video. Now on to the signs in the sun, the moon, and the stars right where Jesus Christ said they would be. And as you can see right here on September 17th and 18th in the heavens on the eagle, what they call Aquila, you can see Celeste Child on the wing of the eagle and the asteroid Child underneath the eagle on the full harvest moon during the blood moon eclipse. And this is a super moon. And all glory to our father. If you remember, if you've seen the last video that I put out about this, I showed you not only is Celeste child on the wing of the eagle and child underneath, underneath that is Yeshua. And next to Celeste child on the left is Arakupa. And this is on the solar eclipse, on the Feast of Trumpets, on 10-2, a fortnight after the blood moon eclipse. And you can see that right under Arakupa, which means trumpet sound, is Israel. And right under Israel is America. And right to the right of Israel and America is Seraphina. And it means seraphim, the highest ranking angels. And there's a lot more there too. But we'll go back to September 17th. And I'm not going to ever set a rapture date. My job is to point out the signs where he said they would be in the sun, the moon, and the stars. And no one knows the day or hour but our Father. But remember what Jesus Christ said in the last book of the Bible, Revelation 3.3. 3, if you don't watch every hour, you won't know the hour that I come upon thee. And with Israel being at war and the signs being so strong, this month is super high watch. And with the asteroid child underneath the eagle and Celeste child on the eagle's wing, it makes this full harvest moon and this eclipse a super high watch time. And when you add the word to it, it makes it even stronger. Exodus 19.4 Ye have seen what I did unto the Egyptians and how I bear you on eagles' wings and brought you unto myself. Well, on these eclipses, both of them, Celeste Child is on the wing of the eagle family. And Celeste means heavenly. Isaiah 40, 31, But they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings as eagles. They shall run and not be weary, and they shall walk and not faint. Psalms 90.10, 
The days of our years are threescore years and ten, seventy years. And if by reason of strength they be fourscore years, eighty years, yet is their strength labor and sorrow, for it is soon cut off, and we fly away. Psalms 91, 4. He shall cover thee with his feathers, and under his wings shalt thou trust. His truth shall be thy shield and buckler. And celest child is on his wing, and child is in the shield underneath. And remember, I showed you this comment, Suchashan Atlas, that they're calling the star of Jacob and saying on September 27th that it goes with Numbers 2417. A star rises from Jacob. A scepter comes forth from Israel. It smashes the brow of Moab, Jordan. Well, look at Jeremiah 4840. For thus saith the Lord, Behold, he shall fly as an eagle and shall spread his wings over Moab. Blam! Keep your heads up looking for the great I Am. Yeshua, Hamashiach, Jesus Christ, he's coming to get us. The signs are there. The word is there. His spirit is pouring out upon all flesh right now. My hair standing straight up as I tell you this. I got the holy bumps all over me. And I have a lot more to share with you, family. And I'll share as much as I can while we're still here. But I'm going to go over a few things real quick right now because they stand out and they're important. And again, the signs are in the sun, the moon, and the stars, Luke 21, 25. And if you want to look at movies and try to find signs other places, that's cool. Go ahead. But the signs that he's talking about are in the sun and in the moon and in the stars. So we go to the new moon report. And Devers Date Tree emailed me this morning at 1026. And they confirmed the new moon over Jerusalem at 719 p.m. And when they confirm the new moon, they blow the trumpet, the shofar. And the next new moon is on the solar eclipse, on the Feast of Trumpets. And that'll be the next time that they blow the trumpet. The Feast of Trumpets is from October 2nd to October 4th. So they will be blowing the trumpet a hundred times. James 5.8, be ye also patient, establish your hearts, for the coming of the Lord draweth nigh. And please remember, 2 Timothy 4, 8, Henceforth there is laid up for me a crown of righteousness, which the Lord, the righteous judge, shall give me at that day, and not to me only, but unto all them also that love his appearing. 